what is up and welcome back to another Mario Kart video. I just released my video on my favourite tracks that I want to return in a next Mario Kart game and now today I'm going to be listing 50 characters that I think would be pretty cool if they added them into Mario Kart 9 when they make that. For this list I'm not going to be talking about characters that will obviously be in the next Mario Kart. I'm not going to sit here and explain why Mario should be in Mario Kart. Um, so a lot of the characters are pretty weird and probably won't be in the game but I think they'd be a cool fit and it would work pretty well if they were in the game. Also my picks are in no particular order so let's start the list. Okay the first character that I'd want to see in the next Mario Kart is Honey Queen. If you're a fan of Mario Galaxy then you'd probably like this character. She was in the Honey Hive Galaxy from Mario Galaxy 1 and she was a playable character in Mario Kart 7 for the 3DS. And I think she'd be very cool to have for us Mario Galaxy fans. Okay the next character I want is Wiggler. Wiggler is that weird caterpillar looking guy who's in a lot of new Super Mario Bros games and I believe he was one of the characters on Mario Kart 7 again. This is a weird character that I want and it's Rob which was a toy robot accessory for the Nintendo Entertainment System. I'm not really sure what he was because I never had one of them but he's a pretty cool Nintendo character that would fit Mario very well because he's been in past games. I also really hope P.T. Piranha comes back as another Mario Kart character in the next game. He was in Mario Kart Double Dash and he looks so awesome and it's also another cool Mario Galaxy reference. Koopa Patroopers are my next character and I think that they should have like the Koopa Trooper character. You can have a drop down menu and you can choose the flying Koopa and different coloured Koopa Troopers that you get in the normal Mario games just like they did with Shy Guy and Yoshi where you could change their colours. Toadsworth would be fun to have in the game, he's like a really old version of Toad. I think he appeared in Mario Sunshine and he also appeared in Mario and Luigi Partners in Time. Okay another Toad character that I want is Paper Toad because Paper Mario is a really big franchise for Nintendo and I think it would be really cool to see a 2D like paper model of Toad driving a cart around in the 3D games. I'd also love to see Goomba get to drive a cart because he has no arms and it would look really silly if he was just driving around. I think Monty Mole should be in the next Mario Kart as well because he was in Super Mario Party and it would be mean to invite him to that and then just forget about him. The next character is for any of you Mario Party 8 fans. I grew up with Mario Party 8 as my main Mario Party game and I loved it so much. The character's name is McBallyhoo or M MC Ballyhoo. And he was just this weird hat who commentated the games and stuff like that. He's a very random character to have, but I would play as him a lot, to be honest. And speaking of hats, I also hope Cappy makes an appearance in Mario Kart. And it would be a cool reference to Mario Odyssey, as that's their most recent 3D Mario game. Similar to Shy Guy and Yoshi, where you can change their colour in a menu, I think you should also be able to play as the bob from Mario and you can choose to play as the red one or the black one. I think Luba would be perfect for this. He's just a huge big purple blob and he looks really cool and I'd love to drive around as him. We have tons of princesses in Mario Kart 8 Deluxe like Daisy and Peach. We need to get Pauline who is recently in Mario Odyssey as the singer and I think she's been around before Peach. She was like in the Donkey Kong games. She's gone way back. We have Mario and we have baby Mario so if we're gonna have P.T. Piranha we should have a piranha plant which is a little m mini version of it. If they had a double dash game mode the special power up could just be the piranha plant power up where you get to bite people and go really quick. Okay now I would like to add Donkey Kong's grandfather Cranky Kong who was introduced in the Donkey Kong Country series which is a big franchise for Nintendo so it would be pretty fitting. Okay and I also loved Mario Odyssey so I'd love to be able to play as the Brudels and it can also be like the Shy Guy where you just pull down a menu and you can choose any of the Brudels from Super Mario Odyssey. Big Bully would be a pretty funny character to have because he just looks quite stupid and it would be silly riding a cart around as him. They should also add Blooper who's that weird squid looking character and they've had a few big Blooper bosses in like Mario Sunshine. He's been around in a lot of the new Super Mario Bros games. I'd also like to see Dixie Kong in the next Mario Kart game. Um, I'm not sure whether she's Donkey Kong's sister or girlfriend or niece, either one of those, maybe all three. Oh, I'd really like to play as Giga Lakitu from Super Mario Galaxy 2. I think he was the boss in the second galaxy of the game. Glidon would be a really nice character to have in the game as he's from Super Mario Odyssey and you can use him to fly around the map. He could have a cool power up where he could fly into the air and then glide down so you can't get hit by anything if it was a double dash game mode. I love Mario Sunshine so it would be awesome if you could play as the Piantas and have different colours 
just like how the Shy Guys and Yoshis have different colours. Alright, well these two come as a pair, and it is Kamek and Camilla. Kamek is the big witch or wizard in a lot of the new Super Mario Bros games, and Camilla was in Mario Galaxy. They could have a cool power-up where they could, they could do a spell on someone, and it can make their wheels turn the opposite way to where they turn. I don't know, that would be pretty funny. Major Burrows could also be a good character to have. He was a huge mole boss from Mario Galaxy 1. He was in the Dusty Garden Galaxy. I'm not sure what it was called, but he was pretty awesome. Another Mario Odyssey character that could be in the game is Moai, the guy who puts sunglasses on and sees secret shortcuts. Maybe he could have a power-up where he can put on his glasses and see secret boost panels that only he can go across when he has the glasses on. Nabbit, who was introduced into New Super Mario Bros U, would be a fun character. He's pretty goofy and he's been in a few of the recent Mario games. If you like Luigi's Mansion, then I'm sure you'd want to play as Professor Egad. Hopefully they add him in the next Mario Kart. Okay, now the first character who's not from the Mario universe that I'd want to add is Rabid Mario, which is from the Rabbids universe, but he came together in a collab game with Mario, like Mario Rabbids Kingdom something on the Switch, and it would be cool to have him dressed as Mario as one of the characters. Spooky Speedster would fit Mario Kart really well, as he's already wearing like racing gear, because in Mario Galaxy 1 you have to race him where you play as a Boo, and so it would be cool to have a Boo with a big racing helmet on. I really love Mario Bros 2, it was really weird compared to the other Mario Bros games, and it would be fun to see Wart from that game, one of the bosses, in Mario Kart. Womp King would be cool to have, it would look funny if he was just really giant in a tiny car. Okay, the Mollusk Lancer from Mario Odyssey is like a big blue squid type character. As one of his power-ups, he can shoot lava out of his head. He had a fiery head in the Mario games. I'd love to see a T-Rex riding in the car, so a T-Rex with a Mario hat on from Mario Odyssey would be super fun. I'm sure a lot of you would want to play as Catacuac, that appeared in Mario's Sunshine, and was in Peach Beach as one of the enemies in the Wii. All the fishes from New Super Mario Bros would be a cool character class to have, like the Shy Guys again where you can open up a menu and choose one of the fishes, like the Cheap Cheap, or the Deep Cheap, and the others. I'd really like to play as the chimp from Mario Galaxy 2, as he was a really cool guy, he had some nice sunglasses, and maybe they could do a cool thing with different sunglasses you can choose from, might be fun. Another Mario Galaxy character I want is Ray from Mario Galaxy 1, the guy you rode when you went on the surfing levels. The Sprixies from Super Mario 3D World on the Wii U would be fun to play as as well. I believe there's seven of them, so it would add a lot of characters in one little section. Spike would be a cool character, he could have a cool double dash power up where he can shoot his big boulder or one of the big rolling things. I'd love to have Gooigi as a Luigi variant in the game. Maybe in double dash he could like turn into a bit of slime and if anyone rode over him they'd just slip out and spin out of control and he wouldn't be able to be hit by anything. I also want Pikachu in as they had people like Link and the characters from Animal Crossing so Pikachu would be a great one. Pokemon is a huge thing for Nintendo and most people know Pikachu. And seeing as we're having a character from Pokemon, I'd also like to see Kirby in it. That's a really original Nintendo game, it's been around for ages, that would be awesome. I'd love to play as the Chain Chomp, it's a cute little dog. It could have some cool like biting power up that makes it go faster in, in a double dash game mode. I loved Super Paper Mario on the Wii, so I'd really think it would be cool if you could play as Merlin from that game. Noki seems like a cool character that some people would enjoy as it's from Super Mario Sunshine. As we had Ray from Super Mario Galaxy, the guy that you could ride on and glide on, it would be cool to have Plezzy from Super Mario 3D World, which was the character you rode on in the river levels. Okay, Glamdozer from Mario Galaxy 2 would be fun to play as. She's like a really ugly looking boss with a crown on, so it could be like an ugly princess you can play as. And seeing as I've done a boss from Mario Galaxy 2, I also want Squizzard to be added. He could probably spit some huge fireballs for a big power up if people get their own items in this game. And last but not least, I would enjoy it if Helen Gravely was added to Mario Kart in the next game. She was the weird lady who owned the hotel in Luigi's Mansion 3. I haven't finished the game yet, so I don't want any spoilers. She's the girl who lets you stay at her hotel, which is really creepy. Anyway, yeah, so that was 50 characters I want to add into Mario Kart. There was a lot more than 50 there, to be honest, as I made it so a lot of the characters could have different variants and stuff and put them into categories, but I had 50 quite unique characters, and I know Nintendo won't add a lot of these because they're so random, 
because I was struggling to get 50 characters to be honest guys but I did it and I'm happy with my choices if all of these are added then I guess I'm a genius I don't know anyway thank you guys so much for watching I really hope you enjoyed that it was just some of the characters I'd like to see and I th I think a lot of other people would like to see some of the ones I came up with so anyway please subscribe and like the video especially if you want to see more videos about Mario Kart because I'm really enjoying doing these I'll see you guys soon. Bye.